another edition of Grandpa Grunts, Grandpa Bell's Grunts and Groans. And at the time of this taping, it's actually now Thursday morning, April 25th at about 5.28 a.m. And I wanted to talk to you about several things. And these are all follow-ups to my podcast now, which is very new in its infancy, rejuvenated from many years ago. <laughs> so not knowing where you folks come in and out of these, how familiar you already are, my clients that are very familiar, all the different degrees of familiarity. So welcome, one and all. What I want to talk about right off the bat in my most recent blog talk show, again, this is Thursday morning the 24th at the taping of this last evening, excuse me, this is Thursday morning the 25th, last evening the 24th, I did my most recent blog talk radio show. So in any event, I just physically received this product once again. I've been a client of the product, of the company, and there's videos and so forth about effective natural products and well canine, well feline, and well equine. I've been doing business with them for years. Through my product videos, I'm just going to randomly pick up containers here. It's a bit of a show and tell this morning. In one of my product videos, I get into great detail about when I used to private label supplements. I'm just picking up the first one for one container to show you. It happens to be salmon oil. If you go to that said video, I think it's on adasanimalproducts.com, my granddaughter's website. I have three websites. So EMP supplied my private label back that I just showed you several years ago. And I've now gone through, in a very positive way, as I said to Tanya, Tanya, and Shane Vaughn, the very new proprietors that I've just reached out to, they've just had the opportunity to respond, and they literally just purchased the parent company. So, I've taken this Focus product for a few years now, I'm 65, for those of you that don't already know that, and... um, This is also a follow-up podcast to a very recently had Trina Felber, CEO, I'll get to her in a moment, of Primal Life Organics. You guys, please go to my blog talk radio show and listen to that excerpt from the archival shows listed there when you get to do so. We talked about several subjects on that show. I'm going to try to tie all of that into those discussions momentarily. One of the many subjects we talked about in that, I was going to say podcast, a radio show show with Trina, at the very end of that episode, when I had Trina on, oh, I don't know, the last couple minutes to wrap up, what have you, and I think it was a 45-minute um, show with her on it. But at the very end, we got into men, you know many subjects and closing out on the products and so forth. She brought up the point of a study that she just was privileged to or what have you. You can hear it for yourself. About aluminum poisoning, fluoride poisoning. I talked a lot about my teeth when you guys get to go see those if you haven't already. This is all intertwined with those discussions. Let me put this down for a second, and I'm going to get back to these fine folks and this product in a second. Staying with the Trina Felber interview, what I did is we dedicated that show to dental and oral health. Trina has just introduced a new tooth powder product with the CBD oil in it. I'm getting there. (laughs) Um, Her, pardon me for reaching here. And for those of you that don't know me yet, and for those of you that do, you certainly know. I talk about it enough. I have arthritis and all these disabilities. My my biggest, I'm not infirmed or anything like that, but my hands are getting more progressive with the arthritis and more like a lobster claw and all of that. Point being, I just had this discussion with Michael King, who I spoke to last night, my vendor for uh, and proprietor from Vitality Herbs and Clay. 
So while I ramble about that, I'll get right back. Here's Trina's mouthpiece thing. Device, it's not a thing. <laughs> there's a depicted video at her website. Uh, there's a product video of me actually doing a live demo of this. That's kind of humorous. If nothing else, give you some comic relief over at AIDSAnimalProducts.com. Somewhere on there. I think it's on the products page there. I'm a sole proprietor, again, for those that of you that don't know it. So I'm the chief cook, bottle washer, webmaster, blah, 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 blah. So I have all of the information finally on the three sites. I'm pretty happy with that. That took a while. Now I got to shift them around and make them look all pretty and line them up on the right pages uh, to include incorporating a dedicated page for these uh, Grandpa Bill's Guns and Grooms episodes. So that's coming. Okay, so that's a real quick overview. Go back if you respectfully do so, and depending on where you've come in. That's what I talked about in a nutshell on, with the live interview on my radio show with Trina. Okay, Trina, during that interview, if you go to it to listen to it, touted the tourmaline water, and I'm going to get back to that here in a second. This product, tourmaline water, whatever your degree of familiarity as you're coming in, there's plenty of info about me, the water, at both the parent website, tourmalinespring.com, proprietor Seth Prusansky, if you didn't know him, don't know him, don't know about him, whatever. Again, ubiquitous audience, thank you. Very transparent company. They show you how it's processed, stainless steel. I'm doing this rapidly because I've been doing it a lot lately, and I want to try to cover a lot. Okay, I'm a reseller of this water. I sent a sample to Trina. On air, she gave it a very nice touting. She loves the water, what have you. We're talking, uh, it was like two Mondays ago or something like that. So all of this that I'm starting to talk about is proverbial drawing board. Take it around the block and kick the ties. It's a new product presentation like any commodity that any salesperson, marketing person, whatever, would present under the auspices of a new product introduction in co-joint marketing explorations. That plays into Michael King that I'll get to in a moment. So what I wanted to do, I talk about the water. I'm a 50-year customer of this. You can find that out and not every single day of the 50 years, just to reiterate that. But I'm a 50-year client. It was and is Summit Spring back in that histrionics and what have you. Please do check it out. Okay, this is the water that I use every day, all day, multiple times. I water fast. I've done blog talk shows about that as well. But I've used, I've already put the measurements in for time appreciation here. This is the components of my sacred clay water kit, mineral kit, that Michael King and I, he was also on my show, I don't know, a month ago. Michael and I just talked last evening after hours. He's out west, I'm on the east coast, and what have you. We skirted the issue of what we're going to talk about. He's coming back on the show. First of all, it was just to confirm that he was, and I knew that he was and all that. And I talked about that. He had business. He had to go away on a trip, and I got plenty of business, and I was busy too. So everybody's busy. It's a coordination thing. So Michael is coming on the show. He'll further expand whatever our itinerary will ultimately be. It will incorporate revisiting the mineral kit. What we're trying to do as of last night, <laughs> Michael has some of this water. He touted the water on that segment of my blog talk radio show as well. So I drink this clay water every day. I've talked about it at length at Michael's Vitality Herbs and Clay. There's actually a whole year program charted out that I think you can download, and I think I have it downloaded. Go there, please, respectfully, and find out, and all the other fine components. So quickly... The components that I have the containers for, I've exhausted some of the supplies and what have you. So what this does contain is the four components of the water mineral kit 
sacred clay version that we talked about on the show, and that's at Michael's site, and is on Ada's Animal Products.com's store page. My private label version of that is on sale till the end of April. We also deal with Michael and his company to the option of our clients. You can obviously call them direct and place an order and so forth. And I don't want to get hung up here, please. I've talked about it a lot. Real quickly, if you mention BA sales, you will get if you buy something, you know, if you have an inquiry about their product, should you make a purchase through them directly? If you just say, I heard it at Bill's website, Camel Cal, BA Sales, that keys them in to as you discuss your product products with them, this is why you're calling them. Let's just say it was brain power, because that's one I haven't tried yet and I want to talk about with Michael myself. So you go through your deliberations and normal sales procedures with probably Julie. But whomever fields the calls, you know, in their busy operation at Vitality Urban Clay. Okay, boom, you get that done. What you do, if you choose to do so, you email me that I just placed the site oh, whenever you did and get the convenience to do so. You understand what I'm saying. You convey to me that you recently made this purchase. You have to email me because you have to document that it came through myself. And the only documentation that you need to do is retort to me your invoice number of the items that you ordered direct if you chose to do that direct with Michael's V8 and C people and so forth. If you do that, have placed that order, you get a free gift for doing so of their choice. It's their inventory and obviously they're going to give you a product other than whatever it is you are ordered, as we all do to let you know that we offer other breaths of product and you can take those said sample pack or sample packets around the corner as well. Okay, that's a long story. You check out all the products. All of those individual components are in this bottle. I drink it every day, sacred clay water. I'm just going to take a swig of it just to let you know it's not poison. Or If I drop dead in a second, mm, then I was lying all the way. Okay, quickly, that's the sacred clay, all pre-mixed and what have you. Every day I drink this for a couple, three years now. Okay, again, obviously, tourmaline water in its neutral state, nothing added, what have you, by doing that. Drink this all day, every day. You know, it's my water of choice. Another version that I do, this is already pre-mixed blueberry powder. I'm going to talk about Teresa Gaffney. My fellow Maine proprietor here in the great state of Maine at Highland Organics. She, if you don't know already, again in a ubiquitous audience, ubiquitous audience, excuse me. She provides teas of all varieties. Blueberry happens to be one of my favorites. I am a reseller of her blueberry powder, which is in this water. This is one way that I drink the water, too, in a varietal way. I do lots of different combinations because I fast at least once a week with the water. So I do different variations of fasting, if you will. I do straight-up tourmaline water. So far, my longest duration of time on fasting. I try to do an intermittent fast. Again, whatever your degree of familiarity is. And knowing what intermittent fasting is. It basically means you segment somewhere between 12, 16 hours, your choice, basically 16. However, degree of frequency during the week, one should suffice, but it's your choice. It actually is a meal replacement in and of itself, good for the food bill. Okay, I want to show you those real quickly. Somewhere along the way in these podcast videos and so forth, I've talked about my kelp powders, and I've talked about going back to Michael King, another aspect of the way we do business together. He also buys my kelp powders to, to not every single variation he offers, you know, in within his ingredients of products, because they all have multiple ingredients. That's also why I'm going to have him talk about his consultation service that he provides. I'll reiterate that here in a moment, but 
has multitudes of different natural ingredients to make his ultimate products. My kelp, in some instances, he offers Irish moss, dulse, kelp powder, uh, rockweed, bladder rack, and I'm sure I'm forgetting a few. Several of them are supplied by me. Mm, we're talking about maybe several more. <laughs> That's something that Michael and I are talking about and have talked about. Okay, quickly, quickly, quickly. Some of the items that were in the sacred clay water that I do other than the said mineral water kit. This one, I got to cheat and look. This is earthen ormus clay. I private label the whole inventory should I have an order to do so. I don't physically inventory any of them. Michael and I talked a lot about that last night. We're batting around some different drawing board ideas, exploring whether we can, <coughs> pardon me, infeasibly and viably in all the marketing considerations that anybody considers in a new product introduction if it's viable, feasible, what have you. I want to, in an ideal world somewhere, hopefully be able to provide Michael's water, I always say it wrong, sacred clay mineral kit with our, my tourmaline water. We hope it's Michael's. These are things we're just discussing, and we're trying to discover you know, logistics, and we talked flat rate shipping and all of that. We're exploring all these options to try and make it advantageous for our customers if we ever get this idea off the ground, it's a business idea. And he's open to trying it and talking about it. And we already did. But there's variables. That's my point about talking to Michael and his crew on those levels of discussions. And I'll try to clarify that as much as I can. Let me take a step back. All of these products are combined with multiple fine products ingredient-wise, to make the ultimate products. And Michael's breadth of products when you get there is extensive. I've tried a fair amount of them as a client. When it gets into the intricacies of all of those individual ingredients, I probably have an overview of familiarity, and I pretty much know Michael's product inventory pretty well now. But not to that level. This is why he's the aficionado. He's doing the mixology. He's doing all these mixes of blends. That's another way that we, over the years, started to communicate more. We kind of do the same thing in a little tiny bit of a different way. And we do the same thing together. Because Michael's products, sacred clay, do I have an empty jar of sacred clay left? What I will show you, sorry is I also use Michael's sacred clay tablets that will suffice for pictorial showing you. Sacred clay is in, sorry, my granddaughter Ada's boo-boo butters in the original, this is, gets complicated, I had one generation of my private label recipe that is and was included in Ada's boo-boo butter. In the interim regeneration of finding out, I don't have the Aquaterra container here. I talked about that in yesterday's show's plural. The Aquaterra clay, which is another fine product of Michael's, if you're not already familiar. We found out, the industry found out, I found out, Michael found out, we found out, customers conveying it, whatever. The Aquaterra clay has a really remarkable skincare application, not that sacred clay doesn't, but it has a really good suturing, literally suturing effect. This is why this happens to be Ada's Boo Boo Butter, Wound Repair Butter. So it has Michael's now Acroterra clay, Wild Main Blueberry Powder, Diatomaceous Earth, which I don't have right here to show you, and not this strain of my kelp powder, but my kelp powder is actually my IKP. You can find that out at my um, kennel kelp website, powders website. So I also use 
I'm an independent ingredient broker. That's one of the other things I do. It's what I've done for over the years. Jumping all around the mulberry bush. That's how and why way back two administrations ago, I, I even have to think back. I think it was um, Dave Grogan, I believe. We go back that far with the original uh, management team there. I was doing business, you know, with Tanya and Rebecca, the very former, now former owners of this fine company, and we're looking forward to welcoming Tanya and Shane Vaughn. That's why I take this product. My memory's bad, so I'll talk more about that later. So anyway, I also use Michael's products in my capacity as an independent ingredient broker. Myself and my granddaughter Ada at the website, we're going more and more to customized products and private label. And private label, I'll get much more into that later. Private label, you have to meet certain minimums to be able to get the private label discounted prices and all of that. And or you can order direct from all of these fine vendors, and I encourage that. That plays back to my BH Sales 5025 program. We have a way to help you out with that. Real quickly, the 50 part, 50 number part is a 50% discount on my rockweed powder. This is all, you know, goes into length wherever you guys come in and out on all these other shows. The 25% is a 25% discount on any other item that I stock. You get to, it's a virtual voucher, virtual voucher. You get to use it to your discretion anytime, you know, within a reasonable amount of time. Don't just throw it in a drawer and let it collect dust. You use it. But you're running no 30-day time frame. you got to use it tomorrow at 6 o'clock or whatever. So you have that advantage. Then, however deeper the discounting that you may want to take it, at my Kennel Kelp website, one of the two, is my Customer Rewards and Incentives Program. And those are all self-explanatory. If you do X, you get percentage B or what have you. This all ties into what I'm trying to do, maybe with Michael, on the kits. I want to start doing the kits because I want to start talking about the CTFO 10X Pure uh, hemp oil, too, which now in the plain bottle of water, thanks for bearing with me of jumping all around the yard here. It's a lot of subjects, and again, not knowing where you're coming in and out of these I try to do an audio journal, if you will, via my blog talk shows in a um, video here at the podcast show to try to create both ways of presenting the products to you um, without you having to endure my countenance for too long and try to listen to me talk with my teeth in and or out. Okay, this is the 10X Pure. And I just put like four drops in this bottle. And that's another way that I drink the infused water. And I've talked a lot about that with my 10X Pure Hemp. And there's a dedicated website that's all out there on my website. The easiest thing to do at this juncture, because I'm uh, administrating three websites and a couple of podcasts and so forth, in my humble opinion, for now, the easiest way is to go to my Kennel Kelp website. And when you get there to do so, right on that opening home page, either in the first paragraph or what have you, as you scroll down the page, all of my myriad of links gets you to these individual domain names and dedicated websites and what have you. To me, that's the easiest way. Because in some instances, for instance, Ada's Animal Products.com, they're longer domain names, but to your discretion. But they are indeed all linked, interlinked, if you will, and backlinked right there at kennelkelp.com homepage, your choice of your point of entry. At the dedicated website, if you get there to do so, this hemp product is right there on the homepage, and it gets into length. And if you've listened to my blog talk shows, Several of them have outtake commercials specifically talking about the hemp line and hemp products. So those are how I do, you know, the audio shows. And then I'm now trying to do these uh, videos, podcasts. 
And then I'm back on keel, hopefully, good Lord willing. I try to write two blogs a day for each respective website. So between the blogs, my blog talk radio show, and then, you know, trying to talk to folks here at my podcast, hopefully, as you come in and out of your busy schedules and what have you, I often refer to this as a big jigsaw puzzle, my analogy, but I think you will start to tune in on my point of all the synergistic components go together and we're formulating a big jigsaw puzzle, if you will. For, for my regular customers that have followed my show to some degree over the years, this is very redundant. Thank you for coming back. Thank you for your support. So I never know in a um, ubiquitous audience, of course, who you are, where you are, what your degree of familiarity, and all of that. So these are for hopefully a library, a journal, wherever your reference point is, degree of expertise, and so forth, as we all do in whatever videos or show. We'll just advance to the topic that might be pertinent to you or that you want to hear. And hopefully you listen to the commercials. I mean, as we all do them, it's how we self-sustain. But we all, in all honesty, of course, maybe bypass the commercials to get to the meat and potatoes of whatever subject we're investigating when we go to company B's podcasts, websites, radio shows, what have you. So that's why, how, that's a quick synopsis of, again, however you folks come in, and that's why I tell you the dates and times, it's a big deal to you, but it may give you an aid, possibly, that, okay, I'm now coming in as who you are, Sally Smith, a week later, with no reflection on that, it's, again, in full appreciation of when you can get to do so. It would just give you a point of reference, if you care to know, that, okay, we'll build it that one a week ago, or what have you. Just an FYI. So that's why I do it. I certainly know that no one's sitting there when I tape them live in a very large percentage of the case. It's all archival, as any Netflix movie, books online, any other podcast, show, website, what have you, as far as that goes. That's the best way I can synopsize that for you. Thank you. So you've now seen me as soon as I crack this cap, so you know I won't die in my chair. And that's a joke from all the bad raps that these guys got, formerly. <laughs> and you just saw, I, at least so far, I didn't die from the other two versions that I just imbibed. It's a joke. It's a joke. But they did hear that kind of stuff for a while. You know, it's just crazy. But it's all good. It's all good. So this is the infused 10X Pure. I'll hold that bottle up again. And I know I'm on slow motion to you guys in this camera. So usually the audio is pretty good when I get to play it back. Please bear with me on that again on the slow motion of the camera. It might be doing you a favor, actually. <laughs> So you don't have to at least look at my face, I guess, as I talk. You can see me, and I know it's in slow-mo. So I'm holding up the CTFO 10X Pure. You know, when it slow-mos into your viewfinder, it will be there. And there it is. So that's what's in the water that I'm about to take a couple swigs of right now. Okay, so that will show you, real quickly, of everything I've been talking about in these shows, my three variations, if you will, of the water as I drink it, as I fast with it, etc. Uh, not Trina Felber. I'm going to get back to Trina Felber in a second. Freudian slip. Teresa Gaffney's Wild Maine Blueberry Powder. I already showed you. That's the blueberry water. She's a supplier. I drink her teas. I use the powder in my smoothies. I just showed you that I use her powder as an ingredient in um, Ada's aromatherapy and uh, animal butters. So that's a very quick overview, audio-visual of what I've been doing lately. This is a really old bottle, alluding to the point of how far back I go with effective national uh, natural products. They still provide this product in their liquid supplement line called uh, Blood Sugar Balance. But this container has been on my display when I used to do trade shows and whatever 
And my memory is so bad, that might even go back to pre-2010, give or take. Because now when I flash back, and I think I did get the name right of Dave Grogan, the proprietor or helper or co-owner or what have you at that time. Yeah, I think it was because it was one of the older Super Bowls. So it probably was at least 10 years ago. That's at least how long I've had this relationship in one capacity or another, which we'll discuss when the new owners, as I said, Tanya and Shane Vaughn come on my show, you know, whenever we schedule that. They've committed, they, they want to come on the show, we're going to be talking about their liquid supplements. And again, congratulations to them. They literally, and I think it was as recently, you know, the acquisition of the bank or whatever, I don't know about that, but I think... Monday past was their first hands-on day as the new proprietors. They'll correct me on that when they get here to do so. But I know I'm safe, and it happened within the confines of April. So a recent new ownership, and I can't wait to have them on board to talk about their fine products, which I've used over the years. And again, they are the ones that do the manufacturing for my private label of the... Uh, well, equine, canine, and well, feline products. And as I say, display-wise now, my Kennel Kelp website is dedicated to the human products side of life. This is why I've talked at length for all the reasons that I created my granddaughter's website, Anna's, yeah, Anna's, I'm sorry, Ada's Animal Products.com is what the name implies, but we do a bit of human product advertising or whatever there too as well, but you get the dissemination and the reasons why. So pictorially, I'll have the um, EMP human products displayed on my Kennel Kelp website when I possibly can get to it, I promise. It'll be by next week for sure, for, for sure, to fit it into my mix. So pictorially on yesterday's blog talk radio show taping, which would have been the 24th as far as the taping, to help you guys out if indeed you go to retrieve that archival blog talk radio show. I introduced, you know, verbally, the Vaughns as the new proprietors. I just showed you the, their product I just got. I just took part in their sale and I'm going to partake in their follow-up sale because it's a buy one, get one free. And I talked about that as a commercial endorsement for them online. At my blog talk radio shows, good Lord willing in the creek don't rise, there's a video display board that accompanies the introduction of the verbal, you know, soliloquy introduction. What I tell you is going to be in the show. Outline, introduction, your term. But the video display board shows lots of my products from then to now to in between and what I'm doing, you know, pictorially. To include, <laughs> I just reloaded the EMP liquid supplement lines video display wise. Thanks for bearing with this. It can get confusing at my blog talk radio show. So for those of you that may not be familiar at all, you can certainly see them at my show while hopefully you're listening to it. For those of you that are familiar, you know about it. For those of you that want to find out about the whys and wherefores with any new management team, please do contact them directly. I saw I ordered mine, <coughs> pardon me, to make the rekindling or introduction or what have you of the new management team. So they'll be on. One last thing that I talked about in the show, you know, as as you guys come in and out of these things, again, my podcast might precede my show as you see it, or vice versa, and all those crazy scenarios that you can create, again, based on when you come in to do so. So you may see the podcast before the show, the show before the podcast, read the blog before you went to the respective website pages, et cetera, et cetera. So I appreciate your patience in that, but that's the best I can do for you guys to this juncture. Quickly, when you go back to recap the live interview with Trina Felber, we talked extensively about these products in that show. 
dental products. I did a live video at Ada's website on one of the pages. Bear with me on that. And then I did a on studio, in studio as Trina. You couldn't see my display then, but she expounds upon while she was talking about the products. I was actually doing an LED treatment. And, you know, I would take the mouthpiece out if I had to answer a question and or interject one. But when you get there to do so, this is basically encompassing mostly her introduction of her new products with the CBD oil. And we're going to get back to all of that at length. But the 10X that I showed you, I'm not going to reach all over this stuff again because I keep knocking stuff around. The bottle I just showed you momentarily ago. We, as a company, have exclusivity patented rights on that. You heard, if you go back to listen, a very fine verbal accolade from Trina on the show. So in less than, I don't know what that is, 14 days or whenever she was on my show, two weeks ago or less, maybe even a week or so or less, I'm just that matriculated that I forget time. Which goes to my opening statement, why I take the Focus product, and we're trying to discover all these things about, you know, memory loss and so forth. But the subject in and of itself, whether it's pertinent to me or any of us out there, this is why we do all of these products. So, the dental products are at Ada's Animal Products website, at Trina Felber's Primal Life Organics affiliate page. And for all those reasons that in other shows I'm teaching my granddaughter about affiliate marketing and co-joint marketing and cross-promotion and all of these things, these are all things I've done in this capacity for the better part of 25 years to one degree or another in the sales world for over 40. And I've talked at length about that in all of these shows. So I'm going to cut it out here at this podcast show that's a very quick overview, but as you guys come in and out, and gals and whomever, as you have the opportunity to go back and retrieve whichever order of succession you need to do so because of why I just explained it, as you come in, you may be coming in after the fact of the show, vice versa. So for today, always remember that VHSO, Kennel Kelp, Grandpa Bill, and Ada's animal products promote good health in all animals and humans. Have a great day, everybody. I'll see you somewhere in one of my venues the next time around. And thank you for referring all of my sites. Some of you have done that, including these shows. That's how I've always operated on a business, is relationship building. And thank you. So I'll see you the next time around. Have a great day.